Hello my dear students. Today we will see another topic of science chapter 4 understanding birds that is feathers. So let us start with the introduction to feathers. Feathers are the most unique features of a bird. They help the bird to fly, to keep itself warm and to camouflage. Camouflage means hide the presence of a bird. Means bird body structure is formed in such a way that it matches to the surrounding environment so that it can protect uh, itself from the enemies or prey. So basically feathers are of three types. First is body feathers, second down feathers and third flight feathers. We will see each and every type of feathers in detail. Body feathers. They cover the body, wings and tail. They are strong but light in weight. They give a smooth shape to the bird. Next is down feathers. They are located close to the body. Underneath the body feathers, they are fluffy and soft and help to keep the birds warm. Means bird's body is covered with down feathers first and then it is covered with body feathers. Flight feathers, they are found on the wings and tails of a birds because it gives the movement for flying. They are long and flat. The wing feathers are used in flapping and the tail feathers help in changing the direction during a flight. So my students, how birds fly? We all know birds fly with the help of wings. Wings are the modified forelimbs. Forelimb means front wings. They move in two special ways called upstroke and downstroke. In upstroke, the wings are thrown upward and backward. I repeat, in upstroke, the wings are thrown upward and backward. The first picture shows, the picture on the left hand side shows direction of upstroke. While the downstroke, the wing are pushed down and forward. I repeat, in downstroke, the wings are pushed downwards and front. The right hand side picture shows downstroke direction. These stroke lift the birds into the air and the bird flies. To change the direction of the flight, bird uses their tail feathers. Vultures and kites can fly very high. Sparrow fly very low. Pigeons and crows have strong flight muscles and can fly long distance. Hens and peacocks can fly only a short distance. There are some birds like penguins that cannot fly at all because they have weak flight muscles and heavy bodies. However, they can walk fast on the ground and swim in water. Thank you.